Right now, both inmates and shelter dogs are getting a second chance at life through a rehab program. They're both getting trained before being released back into the community. And Local Sands Cody Weddle is live in Southwest Miami Dade to explain. Cody. And Louie and Nicole, this is all about rehabilitation for the inmates, but also for the dogs. Both of them just looking for another shot at life. We're learning patience, we're learning love, we're learning, we're learning how to communicate. Inmates carefully guide shelter dogs as they weave through cones and show they know how to sit, heal, and lay down. Judges and an audience observe. As much as we're rescuing and rehabilitating these dogs, they're just as much doing that for us. Inside the Everglades Correctional Institute, this program gives shelter dogs a new opportunity. It gives inmates a new skill. I am really centered on making sure that I give these inmates who are going to get released back out into our community the skills they need to do this as a career when they are released. Around 100 rescue dogs pass through the prison yearly where inmates train them for up to four months. They're then adopted out. It really does help them open up, learn to be a little bit less guarded, have more fun and just feel um, more confident in themselves that they, they can learn to train a dog. A program that provides a tangible skill along with some emotional support to inmates who want another shot. The dogs also clearly happy they'll get another chance at life. I plan on training when I get out. I'm going to start something. This has been life changing for me and I, I want to show other people how to rescue and train dogs the way that we're doing here. A life changing program. If any of those dogs caught your eye, they're all up for adoption. You can check them out on the, the website, magiccitycanine.org. We will have a link on our website as well, local10.com. We're live in Southwest Miami Dade. I'm Cody Wada, Local 10 News.